Undercover. True, but unlike your boy Asav, we've got an advantage. The three symbols. Let's have a look at the map. Okay, let's see. We are right about here. I can mark it up as we go. Check out that tower. Bet you could get the lay of the land from up top. Maybe. Okay. I'll keep an eye out for a sob. Perfect. Not that I'm too worried about him, though. Hey, look. Shiva's axe. Shiva. He was the god of destruction, right? Yes. But maybe not in the way you're thinking. Not literal destruction, then? That, but also in a more positive sense, like losing the ego, shedding bad habits. Shedding all detachments. Exactly. It should do the trick. Okay. Going. Going. Yeah. Let's get inside. What do you suppose this place was? Hard to say. A fortress? Not the right layout for a temple. Salah versus the tiger. Like Salah won, actually. He was protecting his guru and killed the animal in one blow. It's where the name Hoi Salah comes from. Hoi, meaning strike, in their language. Interesting. Let's keep moving. Right. Fraser. <coughs> yep, fine. Come on down. Right. No They've left their climbing gear. They should come in handy. Correction. Our climbing gear. God, a bit hard on the wrists.
Yeah. Well, looky here. What are you willing to bet? Told you it's some kind of key. Gold star for you. Now let's see what it does. What is it? Ancient Hoysalar jigsaw puzzle? I'm making an axe. Shiva. Now what? Now I guess we turn this crank and see what happens next. You think it's safe? You know that treasure hunting is not a good gig for the risk of us, right? Neither is being a mercenary. Difference is when I pull the pin on a good night, I'll know what's going to happen next. My way's much more fun. <laughs> Did you hear that? You feel that? Teresa, mm -hmm. mm. mm. look at that. Holy hell. There's a massive relief carved into the side of that mountain. And you were worried that we were going to turn that crank and die. Guess it's good I've got an archaeologist's daughter with me. It must have been fun growing up, eh? It had its moments. I learnt a lot. Hoysalar Empire was kind of his thing. Took up a lot of his time, though. 
me, if I go digging for treasure, I better make a buck or two. Oh, well, sure. I don't take big risks without a good payday. I imagine so. Like running an army, huh? That's a big responsibility. Second nature. It's my father's company. He retired, I took over. Family business? Mm. Made a real mess of it. Well, you should know. Heard you and those Drake brothers are close. Yeah, well, it's a conversation for another time. So, where to next? That fort in the lake bed is certainly worth a look. And probably that fort above the waterfalls. I suppose I should have asked about the Drakes before I took the job. Not much to tell. I know Nate pretty well, Sam less so. He seemed to just appear out of thin air. Let's head back to the car. Gotta love a shortcut. So, lake bed and waterfalls. Roger like that. Sov's men might be around. Check it out. It's Ganesh's trident. Ganesh, remover of obstacles. That's very good. Oh, well. Figured if we were looking for his task, I should read up on him. Okay, well, he's a good one to know. You pray to him when you start something new, or need to clear your mind of doubts and worry. Ah, the remover of obstacles. But why the elephant's head? His father, Shiva, gave it to him. Very thoughtful. After Shiva chopped off his human head. Oh. Yeah. We've all been there, am I right? Is the gate secured? Yeah. Not yet. I've got your back. Waiting on Cobra 8. Let's just keep this quiet as long as we can. Oh no! Oh, 
Oh, no. Too close. I think that's a lot of them. You all right? Fine. Just thinking of all the ways that could have gone better. See, I'm thinking about how it could have gone worse. Much more positive outlook, sort of. Okay. Let's go find our giant water faucet. Sounds good. Hmm. Okay, that's not it. No, this. What's the trick here? What? Look like a button. Yeah, I just wanted you to have a go at something. Did. Oh, come on. Looks like we're going under. Radio. <laughs> There's our faucet. Now then, I'm guessing this one needs to look like a trident. Good guess. This one's a bit trickier. Turn the water on. Well, well, what's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. <laughs> Here we go. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. Another waterfall. Yeah. Two out of three now. Lawson, I went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance, representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Oh, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. Ugh. So what came of it? I don't know. <laughs> well, he sent me and my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. And off to Australia we went. And now here I stand, on the outskirts of Halabadu. That's... pretty funny. And the last fort's resting in the lake bed. So that's the one with the bow. At least your accent makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname either. It was my mum's.
Right. All right, let's find a way out. Last one back to the car buys dinner. I brought him Maurice. You're no fun. Fraser, keep coming reinforcements. Figures. Hello. Runners, where are you? You see? Do a sweep. Ross and Fraser might still be here. Come on, show yourself. We know you are here. Clear. For real this time. You handed yourself on. All things considered. What things are those? No real combat training. Ah. Slightly impulsive. Run around the field like a maniac. Need to learn what short, controlled burst means. Right. And lost. Wearing red in a jungle combat scenario. I mean, seriously. Just the one in the lake bed left. So Incredible. You got that right. Want a closer look? Sure.
long do you suppose it takes to carve something like this? Years. Decades, even. The Hoi Sala certainly did have a knack for stonework. And the war, it seems. That too. They must have made these to commemorate their victories against the Persians. Looks like they put up a good fight. They did. Pity it didn't last. But their loss is our gain, right? That carving looks familiar. That carving is an exact match for this disc. So what does that mean? I don't know. But we found two symbols, so let's head back out and find the last one. Copy that. Let's roll. Hey, steady. Looks like we've got rebels ahead. Look up there. Parashurama's bow. So, Parashurama. 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 Who was he again? Okay. Six avatar of the god Vishnu. A fearsome warrior. Right. Still wrapping my head around it all. Once more, yeah. gusto. Here we go. Hey, I'll take care of this one. Okay. Shithole, finally. I was starting to think the boss was all talk. I'd watch your mouth. Oh, sorry. Soon it won't matter. Once we. Hey, who's there? It's Razor! That's it. We're clear. Probably alerted to the others. Can't be helped. Come on. You boys really don't want me shooting from down here. Be the last of them. There was a big truck parked out front. We'll keep our eyes open. We'd better. We'd walk right off a cliff. 
You do have a sense of humor. <sighs> Would have preferred a head start over a solve. Not much we can do. Besides, doesn't matter who starts, only who finishes. See that? Looks like another faucet. Let's find a way up. Follow me! Considered. How are you so relaxed? Huh? Safety's off. Are we clear? We're clear. Good. Good to be clear. Let's press on. Just what I was gonna say. <laughs> Some kind of mechanism. Here we go. Perfect. That should do it. No! Oh, shit! Oh. Well, you made it across at least. Oh, definitely. Figured you'd want to take the easy way over. Oh, please. Show me how it's done. Watch and learn. Beg your pardon? Doing all right? I'm fine. Just don't get started without me. Sure. Wouldn't dream of it. Okay, guess this isn't the way in. There you are, having fun. Just like the monkey bars in primary school. I'd say this looks safer than the playground at my school. <clears throat> oh, nearly there. <clears throat> Made it. I'm impressed. You're impressed. I'm tired. Let's get this done. So, this will be a bow. What the hell? That's not fair. The 
Both the middle and inside pieces seem to move the outside rim. Sharama. Come on, let's get this over and done with. Yep. <laughs> oh, shit! See? I told you it was dangerous. You hurt. Just my dignity. <sighs> Here we go. Let there be water. Now that's three. You know, you're pretty good at this whole treasure hunting thing. I'm a quick study. Mm. One question, though. I reckon that you could pretty much do anything you want. Why are you so keen to get Shoreline back? Seriously? My partner turns my own men against me. My lieutenant makes off with a bounty. Nathan and Samuel Drake get off scot-free and you're asking why I want Shoreline back. Yeah. It was on my watch. I lost it on my watch. All right, what the hell is that thing you keep playing with? It's my stress toy. It showed up in the mail a few weeks after we got to Australia. All right, we better get a move on. We don't want Asav to get ahead of us. You know, I've had my fair share of screw-ups. <laughs> you just pick yourself up and move on. I don't like to fail. No one does, love. Let's find a way to get back down to the car. Sounds good. Ah, <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, this is open now. If you want to look anywhere else out there, now's the time to do it. Right.
Here we go. Coming. Right behind you. Get out of here. Should we dance? Try not to break it this time. Sassy. Just, um, taking it all in. <sighs> Welcome to downtown Halabadoo. Last known resting place, the Tusk of Ganesh. Spectacular. <sighs> hmm. What? Doesn't it look like there's a dam or something between the two Ganesh statues? Must have been eroded by the falls. So how do we get in? Mm. Yeah. Look at the crown. It's not wear and tear. You're right. Maybe it was a watchtower. Bet that's how the Persians got in. I have heard about this place for so long. <laughs> I can't believe I'm actually looking at it. You should take a picture. Send it to your dad. Great idea. What? You're one of those cultures who can't work a computer? Just take the picture. Show it to him in person then. No, it's uh, just a few decades too late for that. Look, I'm... Oh. Oh, God, please, no. That's fine. <laughs> Shall we, uh, head over to Halibadoo? <laughs> 